everybody welcome back to my channel and i'm gonna roll with the advent calendars now now that's november going into de into december because it's just so neat to see the contents of these things so i've got a few lineups and then i'll hopefully do them on a monday i can't do the um, grab a bag on a wednesday because i'm still waiting on some items to arrive and i think it's just because it's busy season people doing their christmas shopping and what have you so We've got Sean the Sheep today, and he is a spin-off from Wallace and Gromit. So if you know who I'm talking about, it's a fabulous series. I love it. They've done movies, they've done the series. Um, and it's all made out of clay, which is very, very clever. So we'll get into this. Now, the only thing I've done with this calendar is literally taken off the film that was on it. Um, I didn't want to waste your time having to struggle to get that off. So this is it. So we'll start with number one um we'll go on here i can't see any numbers so i think oh it drops down of course it drops down i have to have a scene <sighs> okay hang on one second there we go oh look at that look how cool he looks so here it says beware of the avalanche and it's got the numbers on it it kind of looks like a game or something like that maybe i don't know and let's get into number one so if you haven't seen Wallace and Bromit, definitely um, Google it. It's really, really good series. And it's funny as well. It's silent, so they they don't do a lot. You might hear some grunts and things from the sheep, but you don't really hear much else. So it's good though. Okay, so we've got this one here. Now, is that... Is, is that Wallace? Yeah, is that Wallace? Or is it the Mad? Yeah, anyway, ignore me. Just just look at the gloriness of the calendar. So here's the first one. It's a figure. And he's holding... I don't know. It looks like... Do you know what? I'm not even going to guess that. I don't even know what he's holding. It's not made out of clay. <laughs> it's just a figurine. But it's one of the guys in the series. In Shaun the Shape. And... That's the first one. And um, on the window it says, what do sheep, oh, we've got some jokes here, guys. What do sheep say to each other at Christmas? Merry Christmas to you. <laughs> Okie dokie. So that's the first one. Number two. Number two. Oh. Number two. I wonder if there's a joke in this one as well. I don't know. Oh, come on. Oh, it's a dice. And we've got a, or do you call it a die? Um, there's a picture of a, I don't know if you can see that, but there's a picture of the uh, sheep. So I'm guessing it's Sean in the vegetable patch by the looks of things. I know the camera's a bit too far away to see that, but that's what it is. And we get a um a dice, yeah, so Okay, so I'm thinking we do have a game. Okay, number three. Number three, number three. Come on, come on, there you go. There's a triangle shape. And we have hmm, we have a cruise mystery. We have a Christmas tree. Oh, some of these are going to be quite tricky to get out. I can see that already. Um, okay, let me just flip it out with me cutter. I'm going to cut it. Um, I can't quite see what it says, so I'm just going to rip that because it's a shame to rip the scene. Okay, it says, oh, I haven't read it upside down. It says, Sean got his name during his first on-screen appearance 22 years ago in the Wallace and Gromit. Uh, a close shave. Yeah, so that's what I mean. It's a spin-off from the Wall Wallace and Gromit. Okay. Ooh, I think it's just going to sit there. I don't know. Okay, so let's just check out this tree. This little cardboard tree. Where are you? Right. Where's the other one? Okay, so yeah, it's just... It's actually really flimsy, guys. It's not made very well. A little bit of cardboard. 
pop your tree together and Bob's your uncle. So, just like so. Oh, nothing better than a little bit of craft this morning. So, there's your tree. Oh, so where would you put that? I suppose you can put it on the game, maybe? Do what? Yeah, you could do, I suppose. Whatever. But, there's a Christmas tree. Right, so what number? Number four. Number four. Right. Here's number four. Oh, okay, there we go. Do any of you guys like advent calendars? And if so, what kind do you like? Um, okay. Oh, we've got another figurine. Yay! Oh, is this um, is this Sean? got many different oh look I know what he's doing he looks like he's doing the floss or something I know he's not <laughs> I know he's not but yeah there he is <laughs> so he's got the cheeky uh, look on his face and that's the beauty about um Sean the sheep and Wilson Gromit it really is he's quite a cheeky sheep um he's got that persona so number five. Oh no I didn't read that to you what does it say do you know Sean's games and apps have been played over one billion times across the world? That's amazing. That's good. Oh. Oh, we've got another one. Another, it's another Sean, is it? Or just a random one? Oh, cheeky. He's poking his tongue out. Look at that. You cheeky sheep. What does that say then? What car would a sheep drive? A Lamborghini. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. <laughs> Number six. Oh. Number six. Oh, we've got another one. I'm sensing a theme here. Uh, there you go. Was a tongue poking out very cheeky right and what does that door say then that says justin fletcher aka bb star mr tumble is the voice of sean the sheep wow i didn't know that that's fabulous i didn't know that mr tumble was a um a kids entertainer here in the uk um he's always well known from wearing the the, the spotty clothing and uh he's fabulous yeah i didn't know that that's cool Wow. Okay, number seven. Number seven. Oh my goodness, look at you. He's holding a little teddy bear. Oh, isn't that cute? And that one says, the first episode of Sean the Sheep, which aired on TV in 2007, was off the bar. Cool, that's really nice. That's quite neat how they've got a fax in there. Um, and not just jokes. Uh, number eight. Where is number eight? Number eight. Oh, there. Oh, these are quite um hard to get into, guys. I'm just saying. Um, I think it's just some calendars aren't very well made, are they? Oh, we've got another hearing. Are they all going to be figurines? So far we've got a lot of figurines and a Christmas tree and a dice. Oh, right. Maybe the figurines are for the game. Um, oh, that's cute. I quite like that one because he looks like really fluffy and woolly. Still poking his tongue out, but then they all seem to be poking their tongue out. Cheeky little fellas. Mind you, they'd be great cake toppers, those ones. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. How can I be losing... How can I be not knowing what the numbers were? Okay, number eight. Did we read that, guys? Hi, hi, hi. Oh, here we go. Sean was voted the UK's most loved show in the Radio Times and poll, uh, Radio Times poll in 2014. That's awesome. I did not know that. Number nine. Ooh, something different. We've got a sticker. Seasons bleatings. Oh, very, very, very funny. Very good. 
Okay, so that's number nine, and that says Sean's favourite food is pizza. I didn't know that. Uh, <laughs> number ten is a made up show, and I didn't know that. Number ten, where's number ten, guys? Can you see it? Are you screaming at me where it is? There it is, it's another triangle. Oh, there's another Christmas tree then. Who knows? Mm -hmm. We just want to get in there, don't we? Come on out. Ugh. Okay, yeah, another Christmas tree. Well, that was pretty obvious. So, what are we going to do with two Christmas trees? I mean, what do you do? I mean, I know some people got like four or five Christmas trees in the house, but um, what do you do with a uh, little, wood, little wooden? Little um, cardboardy ones. Ta da! Tree number two! And in there it says it takes between 12 to 24 photographs to create just one second of a Sean the Sheep emanation. I'm not surprised, and yes, I would I would um, believe that because it is, it's like frame by frame, isn't it? Because it's clay. Can you imagine like. Wow, that's pretty impressive to give us a show or series. It's very cool. I really wish we could see more of it. They sometimes bring them out at Christmas time. It's so cool to see it because there was a Christmas um, series or there's a Christmas one. Um, but all the Shaun the Sheep walls to Robert, I love. It's just cool. And number 11, staring at me in the face. Um, yeah, it is, it's very clever. So yeah, I could imagine it would take that long to do frame by frame. I mean, that's pretty hard work. But, I mean, that's talent, especially if you could make figures out of clay like that. Oh, looks like we've got a puzzle, guys. And what football club do sheep support? Barcelona. Very good. Um, how many pieces have we got here? We've got just six. So I'll pop that together um, after for you guys, okay? Because we just want to move on with the calendar. We just want to see what's in here. I read that one, didn't I? So number 12. Uh, number 12. Oh, got another figure. Oh, here he is. We've got two of these now. So one, he's kind of like in his nightwear. This one, he's uh, dressed in his welly boots, I think. And his trench coat. So he looks like, you know, he works on the farm, obviously, because he's got sheep. Hmm. Okay, what does that say? Female sheep are called ewes, male sheep are called rams, and baby sheep are called lambs. Yes, didn't know that. Uh, so number 13. Number 13's at the top here. Oh, doesn't feel like there's anything. I think I've destroyed that one. I don't think there's anything. Oh yeah, there is. Oh, another sticker. And there's another uh, scene of Sean again on the field. Okay, and the sticker says gifted. That's really cute actually. And actually, now that I've seen this, I'm actually going to use these stickers and I'm going to put them on some of the uh, Christmas wrap when I wrap presents. What a good idea. Number 14 now, guys. Getting there. We're halfway through now. This is a cute calendar. I like the figures. Oh, we've got another sticker. And we've probably got another scene. Oh no. What is it called when a snowman has a tantrum? A meltdown. <laughs> oh dear. Um, snow angel. <laughs> we don't get snow here. Well, they had the snow randomly about six or seven years ago here, but we don't get it snow. We're quite mild climate down here where we are, so we don't get it. Um, other people who get it, they're so lucky. I love snow. Oh, what's this one then? Oh, it's like another little um, scene. So, a bit like the Christmas trees, but it's it's um, Sean and another random sheep, I think. And this is the name. I'm butchering all the names now. I don't even know. But, I mean, I've seen the series, obviously. I've watched it. I don't know if it's got a name, if that makes sense. I think I've stopped blabbering. But there's Sean. Little, little, eeny, beeny, little, little sheep there. And yeah, there's just a a big one here, and that's just made out of um I think you sit them up to be honest, it looks like it, but then what would you do with that little one? That's definitely Sean, right? Was that Sean when he's older? I have no clue. It's like a little groove. 
And he's got a groove. Does he just sit on top of him like he's riding a, sh a sheep? Another one. Who knows? Who knows? But that's what that one is. Um, and it might even tell us in a minute what that's related to. Right. Um, I'm losing where we are. What are we now? Was that 14? Did that come out of there, guys? No, because we did the snowman one. Okay, which one was that then? Oh my goodness me. Right, number 15. <laughs> I had to stop the camera just to check to make sure it was. Okay, it was another joke, So, and I definitely hadn't said this one. What do you call a sheep covered in chocolate? A candy bar. Very good. 16. Oh, here's Gromit. Oh, I like him. He's so cute. Yes, he's the dog. Come on out. Oh, there you go. Um, there he is. Oh. Oh, I love that. That's so fun. Look at the teeth. They're amazing. Uh, Sean's TV show has won many awards, including two Bef... Beftas? Beflers? Beftas? Oh, you call them Beftas. And three Emmys. I didn't know that. Um, yeah, he's cool. He's quite mischievous himself, though. But he's always trying to do good. This dog. Okay. Um. Seventeen. Seventeen. Happy birthday to me. We'll be on that day. I am a December-born child. Okay, come on out. What's this one here? Oh, <laughs> so it's um, Sean dressed as a person. So I think on the series, um, there's like a couple sheep dressed up like a person. Uh, very funny. And what does that say? Where did the sheep get a haircut? The barber shop. Funny, I've heard that before actually. So that was 17, yeah. Um, 18, we're nearly there. I hope this hasn't been too painful for you guys. Oh my goodness me. These, these um... Oh gosh. I love calendars, but man, they feel wedged in sometimes. Oh, we've got another sticker. We've got... Um, we've got... It's party time. Oh. Yeah, I think those are great stickers. I'm definitely going to use those. If that wasn't amazing, yeah. What do sheep want to do? To rule the world, of course. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, I should quite like that one. That's funny. Um, oh, we've got another one. Oh, he's looking a bit thoughtful there. Hmm. What does your window say, mate? What does it say? It says, what do you call a dancing sheep? A bar ballerina. <laughs> okay. All right. Number 20, guys. We are now close to Christmas Day. I don't think it has Christmas Day. Some Evan Candles do have um, 25th, don't they? Some just 24. That says, sheep have best friends. Fleecy facts, sheep have best friends. Do they really? Oh, got a puzzle. Oh, I didn't know that. That's pretty cool. I suppose they do flock together, don't they? Oh, dear. Boom, boom. Right, another puzzle, so I will show you that afterwards. It's just easier then, isn't it? Um, okay, so, tap, 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 20, 21. 21! Oh, we have another sticker, folks, another sticker and another scene. Sledged it. Oh, I couldn't read that. Sledged it. Awesome. Do you get snow where you guys are? If you do, you're very lucky. 22. Oh, we've got another sticker, folks. We wish you a Merry Christmas. See what they've done there? You. Uh, what do you get if you cross an angry sheep and a moody cow? An animal that's in a bad mood. <laughs> Very good. 23. All right. We definitely haven't got 25 windows. I can see. Second to last. Come on out. Sean again. 
different poses. So this calendar consists of stickers, different poses with figures, and Christmas trees and a dice. Oh no, I read that one. And 24 is the last one, and he's the biggest one of all there. Um, I think it's supposed to be like that. He's looking upside down. That's kind of quirky, right? I do like the fact that it's it's kind of flocked almost. Yeah, it feels it. That's quite a cool figurine. Oh, I love that. Oh, I'm so silly sometimes. Here I am thinking it just looks like that, but you know, if you put the sheep upside down like it's on the ground, it's the right way up. No, it's not. What am I talking about? Ignore me. Can you move his head? Oh my goodness, guys. Oh my gosh, I'm so silly. <laughs> yes, you just moved the head. <laughs> what am I like? Okay, so there you go. It's just that he came out like that. Um, He's the best one of them all. I like that. I'm still undecided why we've got a dice. So that's all the windows. Did I read to you what that was? Oh, it just says season's greetings and it's got like all of the... um characters i suppose some of the characters there okay so that's it there's no 25th window um and i've just seen down here it says roll the die yes it is called a die when it's singular okay roll the die and follow the trail of snowballs to finish the line try and catch a lift on the way but make sure you beware of the avalanche start finish roll the die up you go okay so it comes with the game so that's nice especially if um you know, you want a little bit more out of it. Uh, just turn around here just to show you the back. Because sometimes the back's a giveaway. So I'll never try and show you that. If you've got those silver pup bits here, you know they're the real deal. Um, treasure hunt. We're going on a treasure hunt. There are six to find. There's a golden ticket. If you're a golden ticket winner, congratulations. Definitely didn't pull that out, did we? Um, all of this is downloadable. If you haven't seen it yet, get on to YouTube. And take a look at the series or whatever. Uh, it is great. Um, there's definitely no um, golden ticket in there. Should we just check just in case? I'm going to say no. I don't think there is. Um, I like this calendar. It's not my favourite. I'm going to go with the, the sheep definitely are, are the cutest. The figurines, I mean. They're definitely the cutest. No, there's definitely nothing else in there. Just the tray that it all came in. So no golden ticket. I'm not a Charlie and a Chocolate Factory winner there, guys. But th there it is. And by all means, it's a lovely calendar. It's not it's not my overly favourite, but yeah, definitely the figurines I like. I will put it all together and show you with the puzzles as well at the end there. Um, but I hope you enjoyed that. Sean the Sheep. Okay, so this is everything that you see that was pulled out of the calendar. What is your thoughts on this? I happen to think that the figurines are amazing. The details are great. They look really good. And the sheep are, are flocked. And it looks like the characters. Um, I think that's really nice. In fact, I think it's my favourite out of all of them is the figurines, to be fair. Um, my favourite is the one holding the teddy bear. Uh, Sean holding the teddy bear. I think that's very cute. Um... Yeah, stickers are great. I'm going to use those, though. Though I'm definitely going to um, just attach them onto parcels. And the only thing I felt was a bit naff, to be fair, was uh, these little Christmas trees. Um, but then again, you could probably, if you don't use them with the calendar when you're playing the game, you could just um, use them as art decoration if you want. Um, and this one here, I didn't really know what to do with it, to be fair. So I just stuck the Sean on the top of the big sheep. As you can see, um, I guess it's part of the game, so you could probably pop it all in the game if you decide to do that. Now, these are the puzzles that came out of one of the windows, and that's one of them. So six pieces each, simple to put together, and they're good quality, by the way. They're not just flimsy, they're quite good. You all tied up greetings from Mossy Bottom family. So, yeah, I thought that was okay. Yeah, so puzzle's okay. That, that there is a bit naff, but the best part of it all was the figurines, and I don't mind stickers. So what do you think, guys? I hope you enjoyed. Please give it a thumbs up. 
and, sub and um, subscribe and I hope you enjoyed that and then on Wednesday when I come back to do another video it won't be um, a grab a bag I'll have to fish out some toys and I'll do that for you unbox some other bits maybe throw on some Christmas Christmas items and um, that will be the week then of my videoing because I try to do like two videos a week but um, yeah let me know what your favourite is I definitely think it's these guys <laughs> they've won the day um cheeky cheekiness of their faces so yeah so i hope you enjoyed that that's wallace and gromit thanks for watching everyone take care